Hello everybody, in this video we're going to take a look at a game called Stern and this game was developed by one person. Uh, this is an action adventure game uh, that I just fall in love with straight away and I spent several hours, I wanted to release a video before but I just so, so much enjoyed it that I just took my time and continue playing and now I'm going to share with you uh, my first impressions. Now keep in mind this is a few hours into the game, so I already upgraded my character a bit. I have uh, different weapons, different consumables, uh, and I also died against one enemy. I think it's a boss fight. It was just so hard, so I just needed to continue farming for better gear. And some of the merchant that you see here actually uh, didn't appear before. You're gonna unlock them as you play. Uh, this is really cool. You can actually do even fishing to get items. You can even get weapons while fishing. There are different rarities for weapons. This is the map. By the way, that I explore. You don't see this, by the way, when you start. Only when you continue uh, exploring, and as you explore, you're gonna unlock, and you can see it on the map. So you can see actually how it looks, and go back to different areas. Some areas require keys to access. Other probably beat like very tough enemies. And I really like the open space. You can just go to different areas and explore. Some areas, have, for example, radiation. So you need something to make sure that you don't get infected by the radiation. Again, really cool. This is the skills, by the way. As you can see, I unlock different ones. You unlock them using souls, which you get uh, after eliminating enemies. Now, the game is going to be released on July 20th, uh, 20th of July, so uh, on Steam. So if you enjoy what you are seeing, well, make sure you wishlist this game and let's jump into gameplay. Yeah. What you see here, by the way, is a shop, which I unlocked. You won't see it straight away. Really cool guns with rarities. So yeah, let's begin and... Uh, have some fun. So basically, what do we have here? Well, we can jump, we can roll with shift, we can shoot uh, range, we have range and melee weapons uh, with the right, uh, right mouse button, we actually shoot the range, the left mouse button we gonna hit. We can actually kick doors using alt to surprise enemies, or we can just hit it with the left mouse button to open. I'm gonna kick it now. You see, I just use my range weapon. And this is my melee weapon. These are abilities that you can have. Uh, you have, and you see how many you have for each one. So basically, if you use Q, you use it for throwing a grenade. Uh, e for putting a turret. And uh, this one is kind of a mind trap with R. So basically, enemies comes through it. You're gonna, you know, it's gonna explode. Now. The thing is that you have diff you need to loot the place to get lots of consumables and different items. If you go to your menu and tab, you can see the melee items that you have. For example, I have like this one. This one is new. It's much better. So I can actually sell this one. And when you say you get more money, this is kind of a neon Japanese yen. Um, I can see my firearm. This is my range weapon. I have different ones. All right, you see here with energy. This is bullet. Uh, you can sell it, you can just use it, if I want to use this one, I can use this one, this one. But this is very good for now, so I'm actually using this one. Um, um, weapons I didn't find a lot when I play, but probably because the uh, you know, uh, developer wanted to promote the merchant, so I can farm for more gold. There are consumables, uh, which many of them give you HP. Uh, some of them actually, for example, protect you for radiation. Because the area itself has different, you know, the map itself has different areas, some of them have radiation, other ones are, no, depends where you go, different things. Uh, yeah, and lots of ability to recover health. So if I want to recover health, I can just use, this is how much I have, this is the amount of recovery, I can just tap it. And this is the health bar, this is the energy. Now when you start, the energy actually, when you shoot, it will consume, it's kind of a mana. So when you shoot with this, you're gonna see that it's gonna consume energy. But because I already upgraded it, actually I don't care, I can actually shoot, shoot. There are no bullets here, by the way. You can actually do, shoot whatever you like. It's all about the energy, but I already upgraded, so it's actually, uh, you see, it fills up very, very fast. Now, when you consume, for example, half health or any, uh, for example, HP, you see, uh, there's something like this. This is a cooldown, all right? Keep in mind also when I press the tab, all the game is paused, all right? So you can do different things. So you see, uh, sickness. So only when I stop the menu, pause menu is gonna tick. So I can actually use another one. See, I can. So this is a cooldown on consumables, all right? After this one finishes, I can use another one. 
Now these are souls. So basically souls are the currency to upgrade your character. So if I limit, if I limit enemies, I'm gonna get souls. Now if you die, uh, you're not gonna lose anything here, except the souls. So actually I'm gonna keep my melee weapons, firearms, resources and consumables. Now resources is something that you can just sell. So here I have plenty of them. I can just say, look at this, it's giving me money. I haven't found anything that I can do with them just by selling them. So just selling them. And I can have lots of money, which I can buy, of course, better weapons. This is a key, by the way, to different areas. There are different keys uh, which you can collect and to unlock different areas. I have one. I haven't actually visited this place. All right, so this is this menu. All right, there are some things here that you can do. I think it's one of them after you finish. Just you, for example, there was one time that I just uh, uh, finished one. I think it appeared like spaceships start attacking me, so just get away because it was so strong. So basically, I think if you finish these things, kind of more things can happen, but not sure 100%. F, you're gonna loot a thing, you know, in a, a different uh, items. F, all right, so I'm getting them. All right, and I'm going to show you some combat, of course. So there we go. You can double jump, by the way, with space. Okay. So I kick it, and we're going to go melee this time. All right. He can and continue. Now enemies will continue to spawn in this world because this is the way to farm things. So they're going to continue to spawn, so you have the ability to continue get more souls and uh, consumables and other stuff and a chance to get weapons so as you can see here 99 if i eliminate enemies you're going to see that this is a vending machine i can buy things but this is very expensive you're going to find plenty of those in the wild so i'm not going to buy anything so at 99 i have now 102 so i'm getting souls so again, I unlock something like an ability. So if I die, I won't actually lose the souls. I actually had like a few hundreds, like I think like 400 and I died and I just lost everything, all the souls, I mean. So it was kind of frustrating. So now actually what I'm doing, uh, I'm trying to get to the area where I actually died. You see, I'm looting the place. There's some platforming also in this game as well. Right. I think we're just going to go underground. So, for example, this area, I can just go underground. And again, if I place M, I can actually see the entire map. Okay. So I'm going underground. You can also fish here, by the way. You see, catch a fish. There are some places where you can fish. And some pools. I'm going to show you this in a moment. So as you can see, I don't worry. If I die, just in case, I can go back. But if you are, if you want to go back, uh, by the way, before you actually unlock the ability to um, to not lose these, you can actually do that by just going to a consumable that is called recall position. You can find this in the wild. Teleport to home, and this teleport to the home. Where you can actually buy uh, you know just upgrade your character or maybe buy something and, and you can't you won't go back but you can actually you know start from the home this i used it just in case it was a kind of a very tough enemy so i actually used it to teleport spend it and then go back just in case i didn't want to lose my souls i had plenty of those All right now i'm going to show you for example uh, the grenade i can just uh, go here Throw a grenade. Oh, sorry. I need to be static for a grenade. Yeah, I wish there was an option to just jump and throw, but I need to be static and kind of a, there's kind of a delay. All right. Uh, so we're going to go down, further down. All right. See, we're getting stuff, but just. Now I got armor, as you can see here. You can see here the blue line. This is an armor. Just overlap the elf, the elf bar. Oh, new weapon. I got a new weapon. Oh, cool. All right, let's just jump here. Now I can shoot down. Okay. Let me just check the new weapon. Firearm. What? This is 
energy cost. I don't care about this, but energy cost, let me see. Yeah, this is much better. 35 damage, fire rate. Ah, fire rate is, nah, fire rate is lower. Yeah, fire rate is lower. Yeah, I can use, for example, I'm going to show you this one, for example. Just for the sake of uh, showing you the different weapons, the different weapons, really cool ones. This is a chest that I found, by the way. Uh, it, by the way, it, uh, if you open it and go back again, it will still be here and you can open it again. So, because I always hear, I already open it. We got a premium potion. This will give 80 HP. 80 HP is a lot compared, uh, compared to consumables. I actually got the same thing before that. So this is uh, important to have. Alright, let me show you this one. This shoots like this. And let's ch check out another firearm. This one. And some really, really cool weapons in this game. Amazing weapons. This is very powerful, so I'm gonna buy a new one once I have enough money. Cool. You see that my shield is gone, got hit. If I want to uh, consume, I can just go here. You see, getting HP and I continue. This is a trap. I need to make sure that I'm not there. I can't shoot this, so I just need to jump. So there are different areas. I'm just going to jump here. So there's a boss fight that just killed me instantly. So I know that to fight this, fight the boss, there's an elevator that goes down. I need to have some really good things. I won't be able to. I won't be able to. I won't be able to do this. All right, I got hit. So, but I've got plenty of consumables. I'm not worried. Some of the challenges can kill you so fast. So, you really need to come prepared for this. Oh, another weapon, Grenader. That I didn't, oh my God, it looks so cool. Wow, 50 damage, it's a lot. I'm gonna use it. I need to be careful not to sell it. This is some, all right, ready? First time I'm using this weapon. Oh, wow. <gasps> yep, this one stays. This one stays for sure. Alright, see lots of consumables. Yeah, that's the way I remember being here. Alrighty. Here we go. Oh my god, oh, oh I didn't expect that. I don't mind exploring this area, but we need to heal immediately. So we're gonna go with uh, the premium one. Oh, this is some holo drone, I didn't know that. Oh, this is so cool. I'm gonna keep it. Th By the way, there's no way for Marathi to save the game. Uh, I mean, you have seven quid, but there's no like, save you can actually load uh like several save certain position like before boss fight or anything see there are bots here look at this this is so cool now i can throw a grenade there oh another one cool Oh my god, this is crazy. Uh, the reason I can do this shoot so so fast is because I have the energy, I upgraded the energy. Oh. This is so cool. This weapon is insane. Alright. Oh, now I'm gonna heal. 
Oh, my bed, my bed. <laughs> oh my god, no, I got too much damage. I'm just, uh, I'm reckless. I'm, I'm reckless. <laughs> this weapon is crazy. Alright, so we need to heal. Wow. Pretty bad. Oh, well, look at this, what's waiting for us there. So let's see the map. All right. So you can really go deep underground here. Actually, I'm going to heal. See, the game pauses. <laughs> it's so satisfying. The shooting is so satisfying in this game. See, I need to be careful. Just be careful. Oh, another recall potion. Here we go. Just in case I need it. I don't need it now, but... Basically, uh, I'm not going to lose it, so... I'm not really kind of afraid of this. Right, five seconds. Oh, just consumables. Oh, oh, oh! I didn't pay attention. I didn't pay attention. They keep spawning, you see? They keep spawning. Jesus. I need to heal. What am I doing? What am I doing? The timing. Anyway, if I die, I'm just going to show you what happens. Yeah. So, if you die, and I died, I'm not going to lose my... Um, I'm not going to lose it. You can see, I still souls are still here. And I have everything, you know, everything here. So I'm not losing it. You know, in some games, uh, uh, you can lose everything, but here you're not. And I actually like that, that you don't lose anything. So I can still use my firearms and everything. Uh, probably this one will open up later on. There are some other merchants. Uh, this is weaponry, which is really cool. I'm trying to save for some really good ones. I mean, if I'm only buying, I think I'm going to buy some really, really good ones. So, of course, I'm going to go for the legendary ones. See this one? 100 damage. This is insane. Wow. There's some really cool weapons here. In time, in time. I can buy, but I want the, you know, the better ones. So, this is the weaponry. I'm just going to show you uh, if you want to upgrade. There's actually a shortcut to one of the areas here. You can go home, but it's kind of a bit here in this area. If you are close there, you can actually take it. This is if you go here, you see? If you are just in case here, you can go up the elevator in here. Soul Eater. So here, this is the upgrade, all right? So you can actually upgrade any anything you like here, but it costs a lot. Alright, so for example, this one will cost me much more. Alright, uh, so this one, for example, after your death souls uh, do not fly out, this is something that I wanted because uh, when I die, it just feels bad because I give hundreds of them and I don't want to lose them. So the first thing I need to do is just make sure this one and then I'm going to upgrade other things. Alright, so you can see price is very high. Yeah. But if you play, of course, you're going to find it. One thing I wanted to show you is if you want to fish, you come here and you can get some things, different consumables and stuff. Just need a bit of patience. You see, we got something. Oh, I got a weapon. I didn't know you could get weapons. Oh, <laughs> you can get a weapon as well. All right. Let me see. Oh, this is a very good. Are you kidding me? You see? Wow, this is insane. 
sell. I didn't know, just with you now I discovered this. Wow, this is amazing. So this is just kind of a quick look uh, at Stern. This game is absolutely amazing. Um, I just love it. I just love it. It's so addicting and fun. And I like the fact that you can open to explore the map, different areas, rather than having something kind of a you know, linear path that you just go and you know, I just like the ability to explore the map, find different areas, uh, decide which one I want to further explore. All right, so this is the first look. First impressions are very, very, very positive. Combat feels fun. Uh, uh, maps looks really, really nice. Uh, very easy to understand, uh, you know, how to navigate through everything. Uh, really cool weapons and I just start playing so I'm sure it's gonna get better by the way there's also a boss fight uh, which I'm not gonna put here in this video but it just melted me like in like in like a second so yeah there are some really challenging stuff here that uh, well you need better gear and that's the thing you continue progressing upgrade your gear until you're able to kind of progress with different areas that you actually failed before so until the next video i hope you enjoyed this one we're gonna make another video following this uh with more of course when i progress more in the video so in the video i mean in the game and uh this is it i see you on the next video consider leaving a like and subscribe to my channel and also join the discord channel thanks for watching everyone cheers bye bye